All right, you're gonna have to pardon the noise. I got all three generators running at full. So 95% load, 96, 95, 94. 90, 91, 91, 93, 97, 96. So same over here. This is my load over here. I'm gonna bring this up to 12, that's the max. So that's going 12 or 103, 105. 97, 103. And my amp draw on the battery is 260. And over on this side, we have a deficit according to the BMS of 50 amps. So like, what is that, like four conversions? DC, AC, AC, DC, because this is my load. And this is the supply. So we're running at 102 on one leg and 99% on the other. And we have not fallen back the grid. When it falls back the grid, you'll see a line come up. So, so you can hear the noise. That one's going 12,000 watts. These two are pushing 12,000 watts. Those are quieter, that's louder, but not by much. I need another load. All right, now we're at a 900, 98, 101. I think this will stay until I hit 110%, so I don't know what I can do to... Do I have to find me another load? Hundred and... Uh, hundred across the board. 98, 106. All right, I'll be back. Let me go find something else. Actually, the ramp, it just ramped up, so that did. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to hit it. I'm going to have to find something else. All right, found my load. 98. Turn this thing down on the low. Eight forty-three. I just shut off the overload, so let's see if it switches back on its own. I think it's about four minutes. All right, it's been about a minute and a half, two minutes. I did lower the uh, load down by one thousand watts because we were still pushing one hundred and five percent, and that one still shows a warning.
but no fans are on. So it's been less than three minutes. All right, we're coming up on four minutes. So we're under limits on this one. This one's still popping a warning, 28. So I bet you if I lower down under 95%, it'll go away. Oh, and it just switched right back on. So it went back into uh, battery. So it was, that was what it was. As soon as I got under 95% load, I'm pretty sure there's still a four minute requirement. So overload flips the grid. Once the overload comes down, it flips back to batteries, but I believe there's a four minute more, um, cool off period.